All right, everybody, welcome to Driver's Therapy. In this video, we have a really cool digital circuit tester to show you, and this thing is really awesome. Now, let me tell you how I find this stuff. So I'm kind of weird. I just scroll on Amazon, like I'm looking for like the long lost like ruins in some video game. And essentially I look for cool stuff. I order it, it gets here. I look at it and you would be surprised how much of it goes back. You guys don't even see. But every now and then I find stuff that is really cool. And I love making videos like this because first off, I'm a consumer and second of all, I just love testing new stuff out like car stuff, tools and such. So when I saw this, it kind of like touched my heart. I know it seems kind of sentimental, but I looked at its design and I looked how it was built and somebody put a lot of work and a lot of thought into this. And you could totally see it that it was an individual who put all of this together and is selling and, and, uh, and I like it. And that's why I want to put it on the channel. So before we show it to you up close and show you what I'm talking about, let me show you what it does. All right. So you've seen a lot of things that look like this test lights. This is called a digital circuit tester, but essentially a test light, you just connect it to the ground and test something. And if it has power, you know, light will come on test light, but this goes a little further and it's really well designed. So let me show you. So on our Acura NSX, I'm going to give you a scenario. Let's just say, Hey, how much voltage does my battery have? Well, let's go ahead and clip this to some ground. We're going to take off this little connector right here. I mean, this little kind of protector because that is super sharp. And right here is a readout. But what's cool about it is that it's lit up. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and touch the positive terminal. And look at that, guys. I know it's upside down for you, but it says 12.5 volts. Now let's go ahead and cross check it with our multimeter. So we're going to go ahead and put it on DC. And even though a multimeter has a lot more functions, look at kind of the work you have to do. All right, we're going to put the multimeter down. We're going to go ahead and get the ground, hold the ground down, and then we're going to hold this. And we're showing 12.53. So they're both showing 12.5 volts. So we know that the test light is accurate within a multimeter, an entry level one. And now we're going to use an expensive multimeter and check the voltage as well. And we're showing 12.5 volts. So we know that the little circuit tester is right on. So over here in one of our fuse boxes, and if we test, look at that, we get 12.5 volts. And if we test fuses, we're able to test them. And of course, Hypothetically, it tells us that it's got power, but it tells us how much voltage we have. And I like that a lot. And I like that I could do pretty much everything with one hand. Like these don't have any power, so I know that these don't have any power. I could cross check them. And I know that that's a circuit that would have power with the keys on. And we could check different sides of uh, bigger fuses, but this thing is really nifty. All right, and the most important thing is finding uh, a ground. Now this is pretty strong, it gives your thumb a workout, but you know, you essentially find a ground, the alligator clip is pretty strong on there, and that's about it. But this only doesn't test fuses, but if you needed to get into a connector, this is pretty small, and you could probe a connector to see if it's power there. But we're gonna go to this other fuse box in the back of the NSX, and show you as well that we're able to test different fuses, and we're able to get power, our power reading, and we also know that that fuse is connected. So this is great, you could check connectors, you could check fuses, and it's a nifty little tool. So this awesome tool right now is on sale on Amazon. It was 30 bucks, but it's 18.99 right now. But let me show you up close what I was talking about earlier. If you look over here, this is a heat shrink, and this gave it away that this is probably some individual who thought of this, put all of this together, because this is your standard heat shrink that you get for from a, like an electronics store, and uh, it's doing its job to protect that probe. But also, if you look at this, this is very sharp. This little protector here, this kind of little cap, is really well thought out, because even if I press on this really hard, there's some buffer room right here to prevent somebody from getting uh, uh, kind of stabbed or something like that with this little probe here. 
But also, if you look at this acrylic, this was really a really nice touch, this plastic. You kind of see through it. It was a nice design. Somebody really thought this out. And of course, um, you could take this part, this apart. I don't think there's a fuse in here, um, but you could pretty much see this is the connector point for it. Um, I wonder if you could put a fuse in there. But essentially, um, yeah, oh, you could pretty much take everything out of it. And I guess if you needed to service it or replace something, it's all encapsulated inside here. So let's go ahead and put this bad boy back together like this. But what I also like is like this small touch right here, you know, for the wire, because if the wire, the reason why you have this kind of little springy thing here is because if this wire flex too much over time, if a wire is made out of copper, it's gonna break. So this prevents unnecessary flex. That was a very well thought out design. And of course, this kind of phone design here, I really like this. But one of the things I read about it is that they were constantly uh, innovating and in trying to redesign it for better use. And I guess before the alligator clip didn't stick out in this model here this one sticks out further so you, I guess you could see where you're connecting which is nice and then I like this part right here that it's a nice uh, insulated with a rubber to prevent anything probably from uh, touching power or something like that but this is a really neat tool you also get something else let me show you real quick so in the box you get some electrical tape, which I think is cool. It's, it's just a nice little gift. And then you get this box right here. It is a little funky because it says JTS Justine. I have no idea. Premium circuit tester. Um, a little bit of instructions here. But this is really cool. And when I saw it, I really thought I got to share it with you guys. And there you have it guys. Another product introduced to you guys by Drivers Therapy. I hope you like this. If you do, the Amazon affiliated link will be in the description where if you hit it and you buy it, we get a little chunk of it and that supports the channel and we appreciate it. Well guys, thanks for watching. You guys take care and we will see you soon.